of all, a MAP degree is kind of like a ticket to a club in Florida right now. Most of the people that have worked downtown between the ages of 22 and 35 have gone through the program. It's a great networking mechanism professionally. I think the number one advantage of the MAP program at FSU over all the others is you're located a quarter mile from the state capital, the largest swing state in the country, the one that the presidential election pretty much hangs on every year. This is ground zero for change nationwide. You are being taught by the best in the business. Our fundraising teacher is someone who fundraises. Our political communication teacher is someone who has worked in political communications. This is their nine to five. A lot of uh, PhD style programs in political science are focused more on the theory than the actual application of techniques and strategies to get things done. Uh, the MAP program really focuses on how to get things done and uh, also focuses on building your network of people to get into politics, which is very important. Working in small groups in the MAP program, you learn how to analyze legislative policies and make recommendations on those policies, while also giving a very concise and succinct presentation on those. It's helped me learn the political environment, and it's helped me be able to take some of the public speaking skills that I gained from that and apply them to my current role. The fact that you can get uh, a master's degree, uh, I completed mine in 11 months while working full time, um, so that was very appealing. You can have your um, work experience and your life continue uh, and still get uh, a graduate degree. I literally talk to Florida State graduates and FAMU graduates every day to encourage them to take the MAP classes because it really does, if you want an extra edge, a boost of uh, intelligence and intellect when it comes to the field of politics, especially Florida politics, the MAP degree is definitely the degree for you.